Italian, Italian sausage, garlic, shallots, white wine, heirloom tomatoes, clams and mussels, Italian parsley, steamed fried on the alfresco grill, my barbecue bobs, sausage and seafood sensation, baby. <laughs> it's marinated yogurt and also has some Indian spices. It's marinated overnight. Joe here at Outdoor Elegance, the 2013 October cook-off. And today, I'm cooking some Jamaican jerk chicken, some atomic buffalo turds, which is cream cheese, a smoky sausage stuffed inside a jalapeno, wrapped in bacon and a Caribbean style corn on the cob. It's a spicy mayonnaise with some Parmesan cheese and a squirt of lime juice on it. Excellent. Mm -hmm. There you go. Just like you do every time I see you. <laughs> so what are you cooking on the Sabre grill? Today we're cooking a little bit of everything. We've got some uh, grilled peanut butter and jelly, bacon, grilled donuts, and of course the usual salmon. Over here I've got some chicken, corn, potatoes, and of course some uh, Apple pie bites. All right. So we take uh, air out of the equation. It allows us to cook some things that you can't cook on other grills. So we're going to be really creative today. Okay. Yeah, happy. These are all cooked simultaneously. Yeah, you're getting excited. And what we do is we cover them with Nutella butter, and then we sprinkle uh, crushed Oreo cookies along with crushed heat bar, and then we top it with marshmallows. We roast it in the Big Green Egg for about uh, about 15 minutes at 350 degrees with indirect heat. You come out. Right here we have a we have award-winning pulled pork, award award-winning moinkos. We had ribs, but they got sold out. <laughs> That's good. From the uh, as you can tell right here, here's our a uh, few of our trophies from uh, this year. We have a bunch more at home. I mean, if you need, if you need to come to our house later and check those out, <laughs> guaranteed they're there. What they're made in? They're made in. Tell them to come to my house. I have more. So we'll come here and uh, fire magic <laughs> smokers, gravity fed, and then also they are cooked on the fire magic grill. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. the number four position and work our way up to number one. First time participant with a very unique skill, uh, cooking style, Sabre Grill, yeah. Mike Peterson, number yeah. four. Yeah. If you have to talk to him about his food, he does not put any spices, seasoning at all. It's all natural food, so if you like a little more, he still has more there for you. All right, and number three. Another first time entrant, but a, but a category that won last year, Fornetto Pizza Oven. Oh. I'm sorry, I didn't announce the vote. Saber got 98 <laughs> votes, Fornetto got 121 votes. <laughs> Number two, previous champion, always a competitor, always trying, with 196 votes, Twin Eagles. <laughs> and the winner re-selected or re-engaged uh, by Fire Magic to come back as a champion, 
Kusa Barbecue, 317 votes. 317 votes. The most votes by any competitor. But as a quick announcement for next April, we do this in April and October, we are going to have a backyard barbecue, ribs and chicken contest. And our pit master, Mad Dog Barbecue, will participate in that. And I'm sure that means Kuso will be back to defend their title. So if you're around, if you're around in April, we should have a big throw down here. So uh, make sure to come back. Thank you very much for coming out, you guys. We had a lot of fun. Thank Outdoor Elegance, Doug and Sharon, for allowing the Raheem Center to be here again as their charity of choice. So we're grateful for that. Good.